Hello, thanks for watching this short video. My name is Woody Adams and I'm in QuickBooks Online. And right now I'm going to go ahead and run a nonprofit donor contributions report. So I'm going to click on reports on the left. And then when you go to all reports, go to account and reports, and you want to look for the transaction detail by account report. Click customize because we got some things to customize before we actually run it. Now the data in my file is actually uh, 2015. So let me do this year to date, but I'm actually going to change it to 15. Pretend it's next year. Change it to cash. So it picks up, you know, anything for this year that's been donated. that's actually been received, right? So we don't want accrual. And then I want to group by, you can do it by count. Uh, I'm actually just going to group by customer and then change columns to get rid of stuff you don't need. You know, I'm going to get rid of memo, the split, and I'll, I'll leave the amount and balance. It's really up to you. Which is nice is you could have class and filter by a particular class for a fund, right? So keep that in mind. Then I'm going to sort by customer as well. And I'm going to click lists on the left, which is basically QBO's version of filter, right? If you're used to desktop reporting. And for distribution account, the target account, I'm going to choose all income accounts. And then I'm going to click run report. And so I have my nonprofit donor contributions report so I can see year to date who's donated more with the transaction type etc and if you do use class or location you know that could even give you a little more filtering ability for this report hope that was helpful have a great day